previously just so they don't have to deal with any of the new stuff. I think it's a really, really smart ordeal. They're also going to get rid of the Kaid so they don't have to bring the Thatcher. Very super shorty, so he can just simply... Oh, nice shot there from Chala. Sweating it out there for Yetis. He tries to set a bar at the current moment. Grixer is upstairs waiting for him to make a misplay. Won't be able to find it, but finally, as Mercs do have those stun charges remaining, but they're going to be used to attack the site here. Excellent start to it from Super as he gets the entry, but Bulo immediately down to Grixer here inside of a 1v3. He'll have to make this push all on his loads in here. Snakes in. We'll get a free kill against the smoke. That's achieved going down. Nice insertion, but won't be able to take it any further than that as Bolo is immediately ready to get everything open. It would have been nice to have access to construction, but it shouldn't be required. <laughs> Requirement oh. as Geo in takes the it. angle really really punished him in that situation, but finally super will be able to refrag him That'll be garage control will actually side. smoke him out prone now for Bolo as Grixer will pick up one But Rexon will pick up the second the Rexon awaiting the arrival of a player up main stairs But instead it'll be Geonitis from down low to, to take extent, him out DSL lock themselves out of a retake with these toxic babes Grixer on the cross through one of them and Geo that are all that's left here Geo's been waiting for his chance to strike from inside of church and he may soon get it here as Merc moves in, but the timing on the unscope is awful. Kansen is able to grab him because of that and then clean up the to knock him out. Merc will eventually be able to find some success oh. here, and Polo 2 is not going to be caught here initially. He'll get a second kill also over to the Bailiff to quickly exchange that one back, back out. Team out. Rexon now creeping his way into sight. This could be the play that wins the Sonics around, but Geo's cover smokes. He's going to try and work his way in through Stash, but Geo will take him down. This is going to be a big frag for him. Actually going to end up he moved on first from Kansas area. So, speaking of which, Rexon actually even closer to home at the current moment. Able to land his shots initially there for Dirt, but unfortunately enough, now the Sonic's starting to land some big shots. The SMG 11 doesn't come out. out. Yeti here, give the team a little bit more access leading in towards Blue. Super still here, but Chalo gonna be able to deal with the It does not. Geo lines it up from another position instead. Merc and Polo, look at these executes. They are split. As achieved, works his way up the red stairs. Super will get the only exchange. Unit Chalo's gonna be the first one with a big frag though as the kills come in hot and heavy for TSM only one super one. some important shots and he'll get the first one as he knocks down Bolo but the readjustment will get him killed or another bullet to claim that life we're gonna be able to strike true and not gonna out. try and fight the members on site a nice shot here but yet he'll take down one before Crush your fingers here folks Sonics are not going to be able to win out the round. We're yeah. getting up to the execute point. Bit of an overstep potentially here from Merc, and indeed it will. Super capitalizes on it, but Grixer does the same for the defense. Kansen now taking control from the backup gym. He'll shut down the furnace control here. He's forced out with a little over half HP, and then finally knocked out by Nicely Kansen. Place nade. Kansen, Kansen won't be able to win out the initial shot. Kansen, so many bullets. Oh my God, not like this, Sonics. Please fight back. Achieved will get taken down as well. It's up to Grixer. He's in the smoke but so is Chala. He's in your home. He's in your walls. As T it's going to be Mira, so no real huge surprises here when it comes to the ban pull on Villa. Yeah, fairly straightforward Down when it comes state. to state. And this is on top of another player being fully killed. Benji potentially going to be the next up to fall victim to that. Kino potentially getting back up to a more palatable amount of HP. And ultimately, oh. all left on to Nyx here. Exit have no care. This could get pretty dicey for these team members, but all oh, beautiful shots from both members as Marmalade swings Thankfully, back. Keeps himself in the fight, however, and already to fend off some of the pressure coming back in as Benji need awesome. to isolate him, get themselves into the site. Oh, no, oh. and they'll be able to do that. Gareth thinking that maybe oh, he was that's amazing. So Fortunate for his spirits as he was priming a nade as he went down, meaning a nade was left in his hands. Exit have already made up the difference though, and are just leaving Benji off on an island here. He can't call coming. He's gonna get some support actually from Benji as he rotates up through the Astro stairs, but it's just way more annoying when it comes down to positions like this. Nix is running out. Oh, oh Yaga! A oh, drop! Is, but it's a quick adjustment here for the member of Exit. Kento will at least be able to get one. Still has some no, players on Tetris as he's trying to deal with both of them, but Diaz too quick to the trigger all the way the, um, uh, Hulk setup, if I do say so myself. Next, oh no, oh, I'm seeing it. This is exactly what we like want. Knit next to the wolf door. Gomez is gonna be able to take down one spirits with the other, and he's gonna be able to heal himself back These up. Kills, but don't know if they have any insight on that location. Gomez, currently 10 0 and 3, has no info on this player. Should be relatively easy for Kento on and the other squad. Kento leaning into this library peak, but he'll get taken down by spirits and ill. Benji being in a bit of a hot spot right now over here towards the Astro stairs. Yaga more than ready for the swing. As I say, that Nix will get taken out. 
inside of Lawn oh. Curry. Diaz with a very sneaky play back into Pantry. Again, you have to feel for the coach in this situation. He'll get gunned down from Diaz. It'll be X that will back off and he'll apply the drone instead. Ben, he's going to try and come in and help him. He'll be able to successfully end this round. They constantly are getting kills on Mirage without a refrag. Benji will finally be able to find to check out the Nitro, but he's about five seconds too late. Still actually gets about half the health pool off of Gara, though, so not too bad at the end of the day. So he'll be brought down low. Well, yes, Gara will sneak off that kill and make up the deficit for oh, a 4v4. aggressive, but he can't even hear the pressure boiling. Yeah, there's an opening for Gara, but he's missed the opportunity to actually take out the player. Corrects on it, however, and we'll trade it back out against Gara. Benji now left alone, and he will be outwitted here by Spirits. Exit. Lock in the 7-1 victory. Max amount of time to do it, and they ban yeah. Goyo. There it is. So a good bit of more stable uh, ban here on Villa, of course. Some protection. A flag now coming in from Kool-Aid. The numbers falling for Parabellum. Trading back and forth, but a big double play from Eska on the stairs. DP Fire getting the diffuser down. It's now J90 to go against Eska. And yet somehow he's able to pull this one off. DP Fires is back turned. And despite the so shrewd it may be, but it doesn't work out. Unsuccessful all the same. Penguin a desperate attempt. Three. DP Fire the next through the doorway as Parabellum's numbers fall. <laughs> and they're just like that. That is not where one of your two new players wants to be, and I'd Kool-Aid decides to swing, maybe for Intel, but two immediate oh. picks, and but it's gonna be a martyrdom, potentially. It goes off as Penguin's able to get back in. Look at those re reaction times. J90 answers the call, and now it's Blaz to fall. In the water, but you'd never know exactly where. So the pressure is the unknown, but this one will be seen and heard, but it's too late because... When you talk about Nook, I think fear of the unknown is absolutely correct, but in this case, Gunner earns kill number one for him in this series by taking down the Nook, who hops on oh. in another for Gunner now as well as he drops another, and they're just playing with their food. J90 gets one kill, four more to be found. Goes strong. horrifically awry, and there it is. Jane I know killed from the same area that he was now, looking at. Before. Coming back towards this upper area, challenging once again, but he's alone, giving up the man the advantage. Stairs, and he'll watch the holes from below, downing the lesion and a quick knife. He missed it, but that's fine. Cool. So looking up, he's extended to living room library instead. And a nice shot from Flask gets a kill, but traded straight back from Shuttle. Bullet would too, but with the way it works right now, you're gonna run into this wall. So, so inside of the kitchen, he sees one, okay. immediately pivots. That's an easy kill onto Blaz and almost <laughs> gets Kool-Aid. Blaz seems to have an idea though. And oh. there he goes, he knows exactly it. And he gets both smoking the players of Astralis. Some noise. A long range from 90 of Blaz, who manages to pick up kill number three. Gladly given some entry point. And oh <laughs> Penguin God. swings, by the way, gets traded out immediately, and it just looks like they're gonna fight in Astralis. Eska chooses his targets, gets it correctly, and it's DP fire in a 1v3. Not in the hands of anybody from Parabellum. Now Gunner picks it up, and Eska, who knew where DP fire was, Excited. he gets hit by an impact. All of a sudden, Astralis have an idea, and there's Eska. He could have put something together, but only to clutch out. Extraordinary yesterday, and he's on Finca. If there's going to be an operator to do this, it's him. Adrenal right. Surge Shuttle has the left, and Gunner needs to pick his choice as well. Wow. Look at that. It's like happening on different parts of the maps. Shuttle engages on the window, blast back from the dead, as we said. Kool-Aid planting default. DP Fire sprays oh. through the wall and gets them. And now the diffuser needs to be where DP Fire is. This is for match point, and they're going to move to it. Parabellum tearing two players. Uh, battle on the stairs, DP fire down for the count, shuttle follows. It's J90 and he's going nowhere but out of here. What a triumphant victory yeah. for Parabellum, a 7-4. And the final ban coming up here and it's gonna be the last one from SSG. They're gonna knock out Mira, so few interesting bans to be talked about here, mainly the Ying yes. one being knocked out. Shotgun holes that have been made, but NJR finally spotting the head out and gonna be able to execute against Houghton after getting some larger. So will end up impacting that. A swing Oof. in the M590 bodies the Zofia. Poor Hypro go down. Play this Dark Zero on Slaughter. What more at least exists? Nitro Cell out, but Bosco will give his life for G holding things down. Eclipse gonna get lit up quite a lot. Rampy will be able to at least trade things out as it's all down to an Eclipse. Yeah, Houghton or anybody else from SSG that's gonna be maintaining CCTV oh, presence. Houghton night. gets the intel and quickly knocks off the head of Pan. NJR down to half HP, but both teams oh, are somewhat stagnated goodbye. right now. Okay, yeah, Sky just walks right <laughs> up to the office way. area. Very nice angle held by him, and a dead Canadian now gifted over as he swings oh, yeah. yet again. Looking like some 90s NBA action with these shots. Not a single person allowed to inside of an animation, but still another one thrown out here by Skies. And that one will sing true, He's able to control either. As we'll see, Dark Zero able to pick that up for themselves, and Canadian with an even better position now negotiates a second kill. Oh, in the head of Bosco dipping oh. back and forth, Pambazoo 
ill-advised on that last swing as the M590 is in close quarters, and that's not something you want to dance with. Now it's all down to Canadian. He's just shut down. Eclipse, though, the first player trying to work their way in. Hyper is probably next up to bat as he needs to try and negotiate, but with the time going down to zero, and Canadian's still suffering from that drone bug. There's not a whole lot. Also, does he know that there's another SSG player that's near Tellers? Well, not really going to matter after Skies is going to give up the lead for the very first time. Indeed. We're going to oh, see if they can keep shot, it there, though, as Rampy. Picks up a nice kill here to be able to eat at this current moment. Eclipse, he's actually going to be able to make his way inside. The drop shot will work out for Rampy as he's bouncing back and forth. NGR will be able Shot's to eat constantly going back and forth. He knows he's got a swing, but Pambazu also has bullets. The process that they're going to be able to use to execute into the site. That may very well be the case as Hyper executes. Fultz. Instead, Hyper will get himself a second. Eclipse pushes forward, but no, you're in the smoke. He's going to go down because of that. DZ's kills, they won't matter if they can't retrieve the case, but NGR on this back flank may have just saved the round. Oh, Rampy! Rampy sniping one! for Dark Zero. Rampy should hear the case plant sounds. He's gonna make a play for it. We're on zero timer and he's found the planter. Incredibly slowly, looking to play off of Intel and look for something like that where Fultz or another member of the team Pick waiting a few kills. Let's see though if they're gonna be ready for him as they wrap the corner. They are, Sky still taking him down. And despite the sneaky insertion, oh, it is no. not enough. Oh. It's a flawless round. Those big frags and take utility pieces and another gun away from people, it really does matter. Especially Mute Jammer still sitting on the other side of that. So won't be able to do wow. so hot and those snipes out Canadian left beauty. department. Has yet another kill here inside of archives. And, well, actually, one down, another one to go inside of this area. The pre fire and almost the dub from high. SSG in and go for a plant. Fultz actually looking oh. at one and Rampy beautifully sniped down as well as he's going to take down NJR. Hyper taking a shot from that sniper off. So it's working out beautifully as SSG close out the game with a flawless. Theme park. Oh, That's okay. my. That's right. Ooh. Things are relatively standard here. Mav and Thatcher make it so that the attackers... So far, so working out. I mean, Beast Coast are stopping the entries oh. and getting a kill. Nice shot onto Newers. Another Electrical has been thrown over in that direction. Back in the pocket oh. of Drip. Sweater's just hitting these beautiful shots. Of sexy They're going to walk right in and serve as, a, serve as a shotgun. He's ready for it. And he's going to gun him down. Dream getting the diffuser planted. Fox A will need to watch. Look at oh. the Nitro cell. He doesn't catch it. There's no mobile cover for OXG. No shields being Dude, brought just in. Swingers just is going in. I, I, not it was exactly. Anthony playing Asami yesterday for this side, but today it's slashing. Okay. Good night to heal because last. Oh, I don't know if they have a graphic. If that would seem almost insincere. Oh. Sweater a kill on the dream. You need it. They see the Azami, or they see the Aruni for a second. Surf taken down. Anthony will need to clutch oh, his first kill. There's a kill to be had for him, oh. but instead he gets them he off the, get the kill There's his so first many. kill as he's not first blooded. It's true. Oh my God! There it is. There's a first kill right there. The sweater. By of office. And there's oh. an engagement from Fox. He wins it. Anthony down for the count. Slash will now need to cover over towards Yellow Stairs. He sees one, but a bit of sloppy aim. Target prioritization not great. Services teammates back on to Dream, but Drip is also gone, leaving Surf 4 and 0. He hasn't died just yet. Beautifully executed onto Fox. A eh? more in store. He's going to get flashed and push right up. Do they spot him in time? They don't know where he is. Laxing will have to deal with this as Newers goes for the play. Oh, play. my God. Surf could pull this one Surf! off. And he'll do it just fine. A quad be retrieved. More damage being done to Laxing. This is when Finko would be so critical. And they did hit the Adrenal Surge. It just Go wasn't kills here. And he knows that they're really not going to give it to him. One player oh. comes out, and then three will swing on to him. Gets himself back up. But Anthony! Faltering, and it could be a flawless round unless Surf can there do something. Is. And no, a flawless round from OXG. And it also yeah, gives Surf. A close here behind enemy lines. And an oh, easy yeah. kill on to Slash, who vaults on Omazi in play this time. So you don't have to worry about any information being denied your way. There's a jump in from OXG. Newers picks up another two kills to add his tally to three. Sweater picks up two of his own, and he's on the stairs. Nobody saw over towards Arcade, but oh. Newers picks up a quad with Laxing to get the fifth. They've isolated Laxing, and yet he still knows. Surf at the window. They know the Kaid is in there. A grenade goes in to follow up. Sweater on the beat, and he gets it. This is one over by 90, and now lines up towards maintenance. Takes down the Twitch of Anthony. No more. This is a very defender-friendly theme park. As we come to see vertical snaps onto the head of Sweater. That's pretty rhythmic. Fox A. There's just so many angles that you can hold, and especially with Asami, it really does open up the possibility. These Beast Coast are in a complete lock. No way real in, but I say that, but Anthony just forces it with the LMG. A couple feet away from the bomb site. Doesn't hold the diffuser, though. Now it's Sweater under fire in lobby. Dream playing off of that. Game. They don't have any intel. They lack critical information, and they're finding them, and they're dying to all of them. As he As right now inside of the bomb site is a long window in, and it's Dream who gets picked off by Drip, who's in the midst of it. East Coast. 
Inside of Cash, he has information. Down goes the Finca. Is there an Adrenal Surge? Yes, it, it is. is. Recoil at all. It's time for them to push. And the Nook, softened <laughs> up by the pistol. That was a bit of a slog. Go. Scandellas go off. They're in, and they are in it to win it right away. But it's a hail of gunfire, and they don't check don't their corner. do that. Fox A's not too far off. Disco dance party as the Candelas go in. Slash been dropped. Anthony's down two. OXG hitting their marks. It's Sweater above to now break into the bomb site towards Split. He sees the Azami in one direction, and it's Here, now it's Sweater's time to shine and exploiting a hole in the defenses. But no, Dream reads into it perfectly. Oh. Nitro Cell from Vertical goes out. OXG rebuffing Beast Coast, and it leaves just Surf alive to deal with the four from Oxygen. Will he snuff them out? He finds yet another kill onto Fox A. Pivots Real question. One over towards the rotate, and that's Dream playing off of it. He that's, ends up. He's got some major killing to do. It's him and Anthony, which is not the most confidence inspiring duo based on their stats over the last two stages, but they've got something working right now. Or they heading into the bomb site. Five seconds left, and Beast Coast chances of clawing this one back. Dry up. Oxygen. Well, they win it. Seven, two, five. A Stroms.